guys i'm shyam swaptam back playing some clash royale and today we are doing some exciting stuff we are playing the draft challenge which is one of my favorite challenge and today we are just doing three battles no matter we lose or not we are won and with zero losses and we'll go straight away and do some live matches what will be the chart choice i'll go inferno dragon for sure uh, i'll go musketeer yes i'll go musketeer and because it can uh, counter the mega minion i'll go tornado it's a great card uh, i'll go executioner for sure because tornado plus executioner can totally destroy big big pushes like golem and then just tornado them and throw executioner there i'll drop him a good luck he will drop me a good luck i'll throw a go goblin hut just to defend the two spears and to chip him away i'll drop my archers to defend the goblin barrel and then we'll turn this push into a uh counter push and then i'll play my bowler i just had the bowler and nothing else so some we was lack at a good troop and uh, he fireballs he fireballs a push and wastes are so many big push with just four elixir so great elixir trade for him he is again dropping his uh, goblin bell i'm going to just arrow it he had the lightning he had fireball this both the two cards and this both two cards he plays very nicely so here he five balls a goblin hut taking the half of health and i play a bowler and he will lightning this will he yes he lightning this so he is just going to chip us away like this and we are going to lose at the end what's the point but we will try to push we will try to make this game and i hope he doesn't five balls this time a bowler is just dead and he fireballs again so i am opening that message box again and again to give him an angry face but then i thought that that would be a bad manner so i didn't do that do that not a good uh, start to the game we are losing this game for now his go goblin barreling a goblin hut i'll throw the ball bolo can easily uh, sorry for that noise he will again uh, ex uh, lightning it and i'll throw executioner just to support and i hope this time also he doesn't fire a ball so i'll wait for the musketeer as soon as he fire balls i'll drop my musketeer yes so musketeer is saved it is not been touched by the fire ball okay yeah. so i hope this push do something at least one or two shots on the tower come on musketeer yes it will take it will get two shots and um, he goes pretty aggressive on us i'll have some arrows and tornado it and taking the much of this push out of the game i'll throw aggressive bowler because he just uses uh, so much of an elixir and i forgot that it is 2x uh, the elixir is 2x so he is back to his fireball and he fireballs a push again i'll drop a, i'll go hard on him executioner and then tornado uh, no no not tornado yes this this is what happens the full game he will do that and he, he will win this game i'll go bowler and this time i think we won't win because he is yes he is just going to uh, cycle his fireball here and we are going to win lose this match the bowler is very less damage so i'll go uh, inferno dragon and the front of him to just tank a little bit of him but uh, this thing doesn't go well and uh, the tower is down to 1 3 7 8 and we cannot just chip him away because we don't have a direct spell i just a tip for you guys forget this battle this battle is already done just listen to me a tip for you if you get a chance like a uh, draft challenge it's a lightning and there's a bowler so take a lightning because lightning can help you uh, to just uh, do direct damage on the tower and nothing else uh, no matter what the favorite card it is uh, just take the direct counter to the cards Yeah, see, he's just fireballing my tower and taking. He didn't have anything to take my tower. He just cycled his fireball and lightning there, and he won the game. I'm throwing a good game and good luck. And then second match. Let's see. Let's hope to win this battle. I'll go musketeer. Uh, I'll go prince because it can counter something very nicely. I'll go big pegger to counter the royal giant. I'll go Ice Golem to distract his mini Pekka. Yes, I'll do that. So let's see how we do this game. 
he gave us a Valkyrie and a Wizard. I'll drop a Ice Golem. A different. He's going Ice Spirit and Minions. I'll drop a Wizard so that he can shoot this way and then go that way. Yes, he will do that and I'll drop a Big Pekka over there. And then he drops his Executioner, my favorite card. I wish I had that. Or I wish that he didn't have that. Because this will uh, really uh, give us some trouble uh, in the future of the game. He's dropping a good luck and thumbs up. He's having a good time because he's he feel he's confident about this game. I'll drop I Ice Golem to tank for our Musketeer and our Prince. But his play, he has very nice uh, cycle cards. He's he can get to his uh, executioner very fast. Uh, that's the killer of the game, Inferno Dragon. Which will destroy a um, back Pekka and we will not be able to do anything for that and this game is not looking so good guys. He's dropping minions, I'll poison them because the executioner has a little bit of damage so it will uh, die to the poison I guess yes. One, uh, I'll support the musketeer with the prince, he's going spear goblins to distract my prince and a Pekka. Great play from his. He has a very cheap card. Uh, I'm sorry for the WhatsApp message, guys. Oops. Oops, 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 oops. Oh my god. I didn't want to do this. This tower is surely going down. He's giving a thumbs up. His, he knows that this tower is gone. Stop BMing me, guy. Gomehd.net. Stop it. Uh, so, this push can uh, really do something for us. I'm not playing Valakiri so much. I don't know why. I. I'm not doing that. I just forgot that I have a Valakiri. Yes, I do. Yeah, I, I don't know, guys. He's playing very aggressive, and I don't know how to win this match. This this is the push. He dropped the Inferno Dragon at the very back. Hopefully, I oh no, that Ice Spirit play was so clutch. I was hoping to uh, drop that well played, but then I think no, guys. Let's go. Ah, uh, that. I'm so angry at him. This guy is playing so well. I'll drop a ice golem to destroy the mini Pekka. This was the purpose I took him. And I'll drop a big Pekka to counter his royal giant and then do a counter push. But this execution, oh my god, please take him. I wanted to drop the Valakri, but then he played that Inferno Tag and I have to cancel my plan. And there it is a big L for us, a big lose for us. We cannot do anything. Again, guys, I wish I could have a direct damage spell so that I could take this 724 tower and have something faith in myself to a game. Not a great start to the video. Two losses at the very beginning and we will go into the third match now. And hopefully we can win. Otherwise, I'm this game is just like ah, only one win. What are you doing, Shans? I have to go minor. Um, I'll go battle ram for sure. I'll go Inferno Dragon because Inferno Dragon killed us in the last game. Waiting for opponent, let's see what he does. Yes, so the game is on. I don't know why this comes in a different language. Comment down below why this happens. And we have um, Ice Wizard. I'll play Royal Giant at the back. I'll go aggressive. He plays a Bomb Tower, but I, you know what, guys? That Bomb Tower placement is not at all good. Uh, the Royal Giant has a very big range. Oh, 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 there comes a Balloon and a Poison spell. No worries, we have Dark Goblin and Inferno Dragon which will take out that Balloon very easily. No shots, yes, no shots. Just a Bomb damage and Poison damage. We have a pe Golem too. Such a heavy deck. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry guys for this call. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Again, we struck now, I think. Yes, I'm sorry guys. Ignore it. But don't ignore the damage done on that tower. It's down to 360 guys. Wow. What a push. One push and it's so low on his health. Uh, there comes his balloon. Uh, our ice wizard is doing very great job of slowing it down. And give it, uh, giving our inferno dragon some time to just take out the balloon. Uh, Royal giant will soak up the damage. And I'm getting ready for a golem. Now you guys will tell me that uh, that tower is already down to 360. You have minor. You can ship in. But uh, what I want that we got two, two straight losses at the beginning of the match and I want this match to win and win at a great way. So I'm going for the three crown. Yes guys, I have dropped an Inferno Dragon and Battleground defensively to just 
to just soak up the damage and we take out the balloon and then we will defend it with a goblin yes dark goblin my favorite i'll log it just to give uh, dark goblin some extra shots and the bomb tower placement there was again not good and he will poison it now i think yeah i think he poison and uh, he will poison yes he will poison and this was not a very good play from him this side now i'll go battle ram just to give him a because uh, a golem is still there and tanking for i'll go minor to i'll log it i'll pre log and take out the one archer and one archer at the this game is done he is done we have won the game yes no need of the royal giant too yes we won at last give him a thumbs up give him a well played good game and we are still in the game we are not out thank you guys for watching this video give a like give a comment and subscribe down below thank you